Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Um, I just want to share something with you guys. Um, this is just a new content that I'm trying to post and see how can I help with you guys uh, risk management. So I receive a lot of DMs asking me a lot about <coughs> money management and risk management and all that. So one of the common problems that we have in our uh, trading circles in Malaysia is that uh, most of new traders they get tempted by uh, lot size okay so semua orang tempted dengan lot size ni so lot size ni lagi banyak besar kita letak lot size lagi uh, banyak untung kita dapat bila pergerakan pip tu sikit okay but uh, disebabkan benda tu jugalah leverage kita um, our margin will get uh, smaller and smaller when the trading where when the entry is going against our direction okay so most problem akan DM I yang tanya cakap macam tu I always MC you know I selalu tak jaga lot size saya tak boleh jaga emosi you know that so this is the thing that uh, I want to share with you guys so one thing eh benda pertama yang nak beritahu ialah um, <coughs> there's there's no such thing as full margin ok I tak pernah uh, advocate about full margin I tak suka bila student-student I tak jaga lot size dan semua I, I memang um, my mission to be on tenang effects is to uh, spread the awareness to a lot of new traders supaya tolong jaga margin tolong jaga lot size ok and all that tetapi tetapi tak faham uh, most of us kita akan tempted and kita akan macam eh aku nak juga ok I, I want to try to entry high risk entry tetapi macam mana orang high risk entry tak, dan juga uh, boleh buat duit ok so di benda ni kita macam meet in the halfway alright um, so is Macam mana kita nak entry Alright Macam mana kita nak entry uh, Also kita jaga margin So kita nak Tengok boleh tak Okay boleh tak kita buat uh, Dengan uh, risk, risk yang tinggi Okay so risk yang tinggi So that's the word Alright so how I would do it Okay so let's let me explain Situation A contoh Okay kita punya situasi ialah Kita ada thousand dollar capital Okay kita ada thousand dollar capital And Um Benda yang selalunya kalau orang nak masuk high risk entry ni, okay, risking your 10% for one entry is already a uh, big no no, okay, because kita punya um, apa nak cakap, uh, what we call that, drawdown, okay, so drawdown kita mesti kurang daripada uh, dua, uh, sorry, tiga tiga percent, okay, so drawdown kita sepatutnya kurang daripada lima percent lah ke bawah, okay, lima percent ke bawah, okay. So, kalau kita nak satu entry, kita risk 10% terus is a big no-no. But this is usually what people do, okay? So, what what they do usually is situation A, alright? So, situation A, dia ada $1,000 capital. Kemudian, dia uh, deposit $1,000. Okay, dia deposit $1,000. Yang kat sini pun dia deposit. Okay. So dia deposit $1000 kemudian dia risk 10%. So dia akan buka lot size lebih kurang dalam 10 sen ke 15 sen ke I tak tahulah tapi dia memang nak risk $10. Uh, sorry 10%. So kalau dia buka lot size 10 sen okey dia kalau dia nak masuk satu entry to risk 10%. Okey so SL dia ada 100 pip ataupun dia buat SL dia 50 pip dia buat dua entry. Okey so bila SL dia hit 100 pip Dia akan tengok a big chunk of his account dah rosak tau. Dah 10% hilang. So, Allah. Dah 10% dah aku punya capital hilang. I need to cover that loss. Okay, tu yang semua orang cakap. I want to cover that loss. I want to cover that loss. So, what they do is, diorang masuk lagi another entry yang diorang tak nampak set up pun because diorang tengah gelabah. Diorang tengah emosi macam, oh, aku nak kena cover loss. Aku nak kena cover loss. So, time tu, your gut is down. Okay, your gut is down because why you ada mentality yang nak cover loss bukannya mentality nak buat duit tau mentality nak cover loss ah time tu lah you punya decision akan uh, decision you akan blurry akan cloudy you akan buat decision bukan-bukan you nampak gerak sikit you dah masuk entry okay so this is what usually most people do and this is a big no no okay so let me teach you how to make a high risk entry but still safe and will be profitable under a proper risk management faham tak maknanya kalau you risk manage betul-betul insyaAllah ok but itu pun benda ni is still uh, apa dia akan dia, dia still sebenarnya is a high risk 
high risk uh, entry tetapi kita nak jaga risk tu with a proper risk management so what we do is with $1,000 capital okay this is the answer eh. kita nak tengok situation B so with a $1,000 capital kita depo dekat account lain $100 faham tak? which means kita dah keluarkan siap-siap 10% yang kita nak risk tu masuk ke account lain so lagi $900 tu you masuklah dekat account A you which is your real account yang betul-betul you trade lah kat situ properly ah ha, kalau, kalau you nak scalp you buka sikit-sikit buka lot size uh, 5 sen 2 sen ke I, i don't know up to you but account A you you jaga betul-betul now the account B this is where kalau you buat not only you will get better at your trading you will also learn how to proper manage okay your account your risk your risk in the account Kenapa saya cakap it will make you even better? Why? Because kalau you asingkan high risk, okay, okay, you keluarkan 10%. So you masukkan 10, eh, sorry, 100 dollar, you deposit dekat account lain. Okay, account ni kita panggil account high risk. So dekat situ, what you do is you train yourself to look, okay, to look for quality setups only. Okay, you look for quality setups only. So, you buka, you belajar semua. Okay, you cari setup yang betul tu quality saja. So, dengan buat benda ni, proses ni banyak kali, you will practice how to look for a proper setup yang bila dia quality baru you masuk, besar. Faham tak? Alright, so it will train your eagle eye. Alright, it will train your eagle eye. So, now with a deposit of $100, you boleh risk the whole thing. 100%. 100%. Okay. Okay, you dah kat situ you dah tak terikat dah macam ni bila you tengok okay I risk 10% je lepas tu bila 10% tu dah rosak you tengok macam eh account aku dah ni dah tinggal tu, dah tinggal 10% dah rosak ni aku nak baiki balik alright but kalau you lost pun 10% ni you dah ready to loss faham tak I'm ready to risk 10% so kalau you list you uh, risk kalau you MC the whole account B ni pun it's just 10% and you dah ready to lose it okay you dah you are already you ready to lose it you are in the mindset that you are ready to lose this account so kalau setakat baru 20% 40% lose in the account emosi you still stabil faham tak so what you do is um, kalau macam I bila I deposit uh, the $100 in the another account okay, so I akan buka lot size lebih kurang 3 sen ke 7 sen okay, ini kira high risk dah ni bagi I ni dah high risk dah kalau you buka $100 You buka uh, lot size sampai 10, 10 sen sampai 15 sen That is not even trading, that is gambling Okay, you nampak eh, I buka $100 pun I only open 3 sen to 7 sen Depends on the quality of the setup that I will find Okay, so SLI, I letak 40 ke 50 pip Supaya lebih kurang I boleh buat, I boleh masuk 2-3 entry Depends, I akan tengok Depends on the quality setup Kalau quality setup tu betul-betul padu, I masuk Uh, maybe I masuk 7 sen okay? Kalau I uh, I ragu-ragu Sebab uh, entry tu retracement Ataupun dia against the, the major trend I akan masuk uh, 3 sen ke 5 sen Okay faham eh So This is what we do Untuk properly uh, Risk manage Untuk high risk entry Okay There's no such thing as full margin entry Benda tu is just gambling Kalau you baru You tak tahu apa you nak buat Benda tu masuk dah hukum judi Okay, tapi kalau uh, season traders yang dah lama semua They know Okay, sometimes dia orang full margin semua Dia profit Itu because dia orang dah berpengalaman Dia orang dah tahu kat mana nak masuk Okay, it's a different thing It, This, I'm talking about this to all new traders Faham tak? So, bila you nak Kalau you nak masuk high risk entry pun You akan uh, You akan buat risk management yang sesuai Based on situation macam ni Macam I tunjuk tadi Okay, so it's a, it's a, it's a good It's a good method for you to to discipline yourself, okay, to have a proper risk management. Okay, so what what do I want to do now? Okay, so what do I want to do now? Um, I ada GA, okay, I see one quality setup. Right now price is at 1.8193, okay, 8.11193, okay. So I'm expecting this price to go uh, bullish the moment the price touches here. So I think the price will touch here and then kita akan pancut ni atas. So what I'll do is uh. Okay, I'll create a new order. Alright, I'll create a new order and uh, we're gonna buy limit at 1.80559 with a stop loss of 50 pips. Okay, uh, 4498 get also 1.79. Uh, that's 450 right now. 
pukul 7 9 alright so i akan buka my lot size is about So, okay um, I dah buka by limit kat sini Okay, I dah buka by limit kat sini This one, this level Wait, let me check out now, check this Okay, so I buka um, by limit kat sini Alright so I have a 55, sorry, 56, 55, okay, 55 pips, okay, to maybe, uh, okay, sorry, jap, kita nak tengok, uh, alright, so kita nak ambil take profit somewhere around this level, okay, kita nak because dia, we are expecting this price to break out, okay, at least up to this level, 1.82, 1.82252. So we're gonna change our TP to 1.82. Alright, so kita dah tak TP kita kat sini. <coughs> so now we'll see what happened. Alright, so now you guys have seen me placing my entries. Okay, kita nak tunggu. Uh, I will update you guys on this setup. We'll see what happened in a few days. Kita tengok setup ni tunggu berapa hari baru sampai. Alright, so we'll see so i'll see you guys in the next video uh thank you so much and if you guys need to know anything about tenang effects you guys can just dm me on telegram on instagram or find and uh, easily just find me at uh the instagram tenang at tenang.fx all right so thank you so much assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh okay guys so i'm just lazy to actually set up a proper recording on my computer because i just want to show you the update on our how to properly risk manage your high risk entry by separating accounts okay so here's another account that we make an entry from okay so here's the result so yeah so that's the result okay so i have one loss there um with a, pro a total profit of 2226 okay so this is from the analysis that we make together for gu okay so this is gu and why I actually lost is because uh, yang ni I tersilap letak this is totally my mistake because kalau you tengok price dengan SLI tu is less than 100 pips dalam video dah bagi tahu dah kan so SL is about 100 pips because kita punya target is 200 but because walaupun kena SL because I know this is a quality setup so you, as you can see I masuk dekat 1.80315 79414 dekat situ kita dah masuk 300 pips okay so we have profited 300 pips and then it's about 2955 Okay, obviously this is a different, this is a big amount because um, I deposit 10k, uh, so it's a different, of course it's different, alright, <coughs> so there you go, uh, you guys can do that in uh, in your trading and again, I'm recording this from my phone, <laughs> so it's just impossible if I want to I want to edit anything or what, so you guys can see, let me show, yeah, there you go, it's real, alright, so because some people just ask okay so yeah um i hope you guys get something from these videos um you know like why we actually separate the account to properly risk manage and there you go thank you so much for watching